What's up, Pan Dudes? Peter Von Panda here. <clears throat> Just received this Yesu uh, watch band adapter for the Apple Watch and uh, true unboxing. I haven't looked at it. Just uh, got it. But I film it as I'm opening this sucker up. And the cool thing about it is it comes with a tool, watch tool, with um, a punch on that end and then the watch band removal tool which is a kind of a forked small screwdriver to get uh, spring bars out and then in here it comes actually with uh, three spring bars which is cool so an extra spring bar and then the two watch band adapters um, this is a little different than the other watch band adapter that I showed you and I'm gonna put bust one out here and of course I'm gonna Show you these in an Apple Watch in another video, but the um, the adapter on this one is interesting because I didn't necessarily order it this way, but uh, or I don't think it gave me any options on the the version. But the the part that would show is polished steel, but everything else is kind of like that shot peen satin finish. Which the watch I have coming is the uh, sports, so the aluminum. Uh, with the brush finish and I think this finish here would match better than this finish here of course taking a polished finish and making it brushed or satin is pretty easy taking a uh, satin finish and making it uh, brushed or shiny is much more difficult okay the th a couple things I'll quick sh throw out here is that um, it looks like nice construction it's got this uh, detent here um, the little polymer or plastic rubber um, spacers or sliders as well but as you can see this watch band as opposed to the other one that I showed you that you kind of assemble with the watch band pre-installed allows for a spring bar and this is the spring bar and so the cool thing about this is you can install these watch band adapters in place of the watch band that you already have and then change your watch band at your convenience because it's actually very easy to put spring bars in and remove them and uh, you would just use the watch band tool to get it in there and I have a watch band here one that I'm planning on using with a Y Apple watch and it's a 24 millimeter watch band and look at that this advertises as a 24 millimeter watch band adapter and it's perfect it's nice tight fit um, to install it you would just install a spring bar you would then go ahead and put it in and use the tool and you can actually use your finger in some cases to kind of get it in there um, and then slide it in there and pop it in there I'm not gonna do that right now but um, in in one of the reasons why that's nice is because I actually don't have the Apple watch yet and I don't know which end is up although this looks like it is doesn't matter but I'm assuming this detent only works one way and so you can put this in first, figure out which end is up, and then install your watch band appropriately because the last thing you would want to do is um, have that showing uh, this side being out and then having to reassemble and so it's really easy to get spring bars in and out. So this is uh, the watch band I'm really uh, excited about using. The cool thing is it's uh, a little bit more of a traditional watch lug style. So uh, I'll take the spring bar out here so I can just kind of put it in like you'd see it. So I can put in a 24 millimeter watch band like that and it just gives it uh, a, a look like more of a, a typical watch you know if you if you if you if you're looking at that part you've got lugs coming up holding bracing in that watch band as opposed to the curved arms of the Apple watch that kind of make those permanent so and here's another 24 millimeter watch band different color and again um, I think that looks great so cool thing is with this I know there's some like Kickstarter projects going on trying to develop these bands you know what if this works and the fit is good and it looks professional um, and there's a lot of gap and they don't fall out I don't need to know why the world would need a bunch of variations on this you know the one with the spring bar and the one without would be just enough just fine again like I said I didn't see any sizes other than 24 millimeters in the 42 millimeter watch size now they had one for I think it's 38 millimeter and I think that is maybe a 20 I assume it's a 20 or 22 millimeter uh, uh, lug width here so um, you know your choice on which Apple watch you have but just keep that in mind if you've got the 42 millimeter 
you're going to have to deal with a 24 millimeter wide watch band. Now this one is uh, straight, so it's 24 millimeters end to end. You can certainly get one that's tapered, 24 millimeters up here, down to 22, or even down to 20, so it kind of tapers and gets thinner um, if that's more your style. But uh, up here, you don't have much of a choice. So Peter Von Panda, look, checking out these uh, Yesu smartphone um, a smartphone accessory special is cool. Uh, Apple Watch band adapter. Out.